All right, welcome back. This guy is super funny. He's hilarious. His name is Mark Bennett. Uh, now, no pressure now, Mark, because no, I said thanks. you're super funny and you're hilarious and all this good stuff. Yeah. Comedian and the host of I Said Shut Up. That's right. That's the podcast, That's my right? podcast. It's funny that you mention it. Yeah. Huh? I have a t <laughs> Got a t-shirt that says the same I, thing I, that I, I just said there. Um, how long have you been a comedian? I've been a comedian for 15 years. 15 years 15 at this years. point. Wow. Yeah. Okay, let's go back then 15 years ago. Why did you just decide to take off? Because this is a pretty tough career. Yeah. Can't uh, be easy. It's very simple. I am terrible. At everything else, this okay. is the only. It's stand up is so simple. If you get past the nerves, you just stand up on stage and, and tell jokes about poop. That's it. That's, that's, all, you, that's all you need to so do. So that's the content of your show. Yeah. And yeah. the podcast that's as well. The entire just. forty-five minutes of talking about poop. Is, uh, <laughs> and it's been I feel like it's early to be to, to be mentioning this. Is that's it too okay. Early? It's, yeah. it's never too early. I also on, feel like this is Roger like CV. a hard hitting word. Like an expose. Yes, like you're I'm about just, to gotcha questions. I'm going to get into all kinds of Trump questions oh, in moments, oh, too, yeah. so just oh, be prepared for that. No, I'm not going to. Okay. So, um, uh, now you started your career uh, in Ottawa? I did. A at a venue? I did. You okay. have done your research. Well, we friend. talked before. You know, uh, we did. In advance. Yeah. So, tell us about your first time I in Ottawa. I thought we were going to do TV magic. But we did. <laughs> this is we TV just, magic. We don't need we to let them know at home how, how this came to be. So I am from Newfoundland originally, which is why I talk uh, very funny. I didn't notice that. No, no. I don't have your smooth radio. <laughs> uh, listen to that. No, you're smooth, smooth looking fellow. No, that's so that's, smooth looking. That yeah. means something for sure. Yeah. But yeah, I uh, started in Newfoundland and then uh, when I was about, finished university there, and when I was about 24, I wanted to start stand-up. My brother lived in Ottawa mm -hmm. and uh, I knew Norm Macdonald had started at the Yuck Yucks in Ottawa, and yeah. as well, Jim Carrey. Amazing, right? So then I was like, well, obviously, I'm going to go. Yeah. I'll start there. Yeah. And it went great. Uh, there's uh, uh, the manager of the Ottawa Yuck Yucks, uh, Howie, who was very nice to me. He let me uh, do their amateur nights. He gave me my first pro spot. Uh, I moved over to Toronto, started to do pretty well there. And uh, I, uh, yeah, and I kept going from there. And now I don't do Yuck Yucks because if people don't know, uh, Yuck Yucks uh, is its own company, mm -hmm. so you sign a contract with Yuck Yucks and you do their clubs if you're one of their comedians. Okay. And then there's a bunch of other comedy clubs which are technically independent, and that's the circuit I do. Okay. Yeah. So you're actually in town though, uh, so it kicks off tonight. It does. At Absolute Comedy. I have eight shows at Absolute Comedy on Preston Street. Okay. Preston Street. Have you performed at Absolute before? Yes. Yeah. I've been there many times, ever since it opened, I think uh, 11 or 12 years yeah, ago. Yeah, it's been a while since yeah. it's been on the scene. Yeah. But have you ever done eight shows in a row at one venue? Because that just seems like a lot. Yes, I, we do it every time. And sometimes when it's uh, really high season, they'll do three shows on a Saturday. So you will do, you'll do the show uh, at the venue, you get a car ride to another venue, do a show in between your third show, and by the end of it, you literally have to ask the audience, have I told you this joke yet? Because <laughs> it feels like you. Yeah. Yeah, I could imagine. I've literally seen guys repeat this stuff and go, oh, wait, I've done that, haven't I? No. Okay. Just like, yeah. Yeah. Okay. So, but you moved to the U.S. for a while. I did. Okay. I moved uh, to Los Angeles, California. Okay. Yeah. Because I did what all the comedians here feel like they have to do, mm -hmm. which is, this is why it's why I'm here. It's Dylan, I'm on the show yeah. to talk about some real stuff. Yeah. I, um, I feel like the Canadian comedians, we shouldn't have to move, but right now we do. We have no star system, at least for the English-speaking Canadians. I find the people in Quebec are doing a pretty good job. Okay. Uh, I've had the comedians there seem to make a nice living. Uh, people seem to know who they are. They got a nice little star system going. But here in uh, the English-speaking Canada, we just, if you don't move to the United States, yeah. your career just kind of... You're the comedian at the comedy club. Okay. You know, like your viewers, they don't know who I am. Even though I've been doing it for 15 years, headlining clubs, doing theaters, things like that, being on TV a bunch of times, and people are like, ah, let's go see the comedy at the comedy club. Okay. So I would like to change it a little bit to have people recognize the good stand-ups in Canada. Okay. I'm going to start in Toronto because that's where I live, and I'm going to try to rent out venues and promote it, and then maybe try to sell it to a streaming service, Netflix, Amazon, something like that. Interesting. And then uh, that way, get a little notoriety for the Canadian comedian, so maybe we don't have to move. Yeah, of course. You know? but, but you're also trying to do this through your podcast. I am. Yeah. 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 So tell us, and now I, I Said Shut Up is the name of the podcast. I it's been going for a year. Yeah. My yeah. wife said to me this morning, she said, are you allowed to say shut up on TV? Shut up is okay. I think. And I said, I think since the dawn of television. Yeah, I don't think it's an issue. I don't think I'm so. I'm not feeling any red flags going on here. So. <laughs> It'd be great if you got canceled. Just be <laughs> and he said, shut Yay. up. Thanks, Mark. Yeah. Uh, okay, so what is it all about? With this it podcast? is about uh, 
what isn't it about, yeah. Dylan? Huh? Yeah. It is just me rambling about everything I'm thinking. Uh, it's my favorite type of podcast. That's why I'm doing it. But my uh, there's a guy, Bill Burr. A lot of uh, your viewers would yeah. know the comedian Bill Burr. He does a very popular version of it where he speaks for an hour just on it. He does it twice a week. And uh, I really like that. A lot of times I don't want to hear a guest. I don't care what they have to say. I like tuning in to hear what this guy has to say. Yeah. And also, as stand-ups, you know, our guests are usually other stand-ups. And the schedules are very hard to coordinate. Your podcast ends up falling apart if you want to do... Uh, I just heard my Newfie voice falling apart. <laughs> <laughs> I, Once again, I didn't notice. Oh, okay, good. We have about a minute left, just to let you know. Oh, a minute yeah, left. Yeah, I know. we got to end this big. Oh, yeah. Hold on. I, yeah. I'll, uh, <laughs> should I drop my pants? No, like, please don't. <laughs> please, I, please don't. I appreciate the yeah, please. It's, I'm saving that for the end of the show, so oh, you're okay. going to steal my I, I don't want to steal your yeah. closer. Okay. You know, we might be out of time now. I'm not exactly sure, but uh, Mark... <laughs> The MarkBennett.com uh, is the place to go to to find yeah, out more about what you're doing. Yeah, uh, Go uh, The podcast, as I said, shut up. Uh, follow me on Instagram. Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. Do you put lots of food pictures up there? Uh, as many as I can. Nice. I literally did food pictures yesterday. I <laughs> ran out of ideas. That's the way to do it. Okay. <laughs> AbsoluteComedy.ca for more details, of course. And it kicks off tonight in an eight, eight show stand. Yeah. Incredible. In I am incredible. Stay in Thank shape. You. Get your rest. Mark Bennett, Bennett is incredible. <laughs> He just said it. Uh, we've got more coming up. What is circuit dating all about? More details next on Daytime Ottawa.